Hello, all you hot mamas out there, or maybe non-mamas, whoever you are watching this page, thank you guys for taking the time to watch this. I wanted to talk to you guys today about feeling tired all the time, because I know I have been in that place where I was like, I can't work out, I am freaking exhausted. Why would I ever wanna work out when I can barely even get out of bed? You know, or I just wanna go take a nap right now, I don't feel like it. And I'm here to tell you today a few tips about why you are probably feeling so tired. Number one, you are probably dehydrated. We are supposed to drink half of our body weight in ounces every day. So if you weigh 120 pounds, you need to be drinking at least 60 ounces of water a day. Once you get to that point where you are drinking your allotted amount of water every day, there is gonna be like this all of a sudden change where like, holy shit, I feel so amazing. I feel so much better right now. And it's gonna keep you drinking water. Some of us don't like water. Um, I can understand that, I've been there before. Uh, now I love drinking water, but if you don't like drinking water, add some stuff to it. Add some cucumber slices, add some mint, add some ra raspberries, add some lemon. Like whatever you gotta do to make the water taste good so that you're gonna drink your allotted amount. Um, just don't count other things as your quote water intake. Tea does not count, coffee does not count, obviously soda, even if it's like soda water, like sparkling water, that doesn't count. It has to be water water. Um, another thing why you might be so tired is you aren't moving your body. If you are just sitting on the couch all day or sitting at your desk all day, there's no wonder why you're not why you're tired because your body isn't moving. Your body is in a state of just rest. So once you get your body up and moving, I know it's hard to like push yourself to actually get up and do some exercise. I, you know, it's almost a daily struggle for me too, but you know what, I do it anyways because I know that when I'm feeling tired, it's because my body isn't moving and I need to get up and get my workout started. And if you just start, there's no way you're gonna stop in the middle of it. So if you got a 30 minute workout and you're not looking forward to it, because I definitely have those days, especially on the days I'm tired, I get up and I do it anyways because I know that if I just get it started, I will finish it all the way through. Another reason why you might be feeling tired is you either aren't eating enough or you are eating processed foods. Literally, the processed foods on our bodies is absolutely horrible. There's chemicals in them. You're putting chemicals into your body. So if it is coming out of a box or if it is something that has a shelf life where it can just hang out on the shelf until, you know, 2022, do you really want to be putting that into your body? Probably not. And when you are putting it into your body, all of a sudden, like we, from an evolutionary standpoint, we were not meant to digest those chemicals that are put in our food. And the sad thing is, is that most of these chemicals and things are illegal in other countries. They're illegal in Europe, but not in the US for whatever reason. Personally, I think it's all one big like money-making scheme to make us all sick. So the USDA like approves this like crap to put into our food and it makes us all sick, it makes us fat, it gives us heart disease, and then the insurance companies make all this money because people are continuing to get sick and it's just this like horrible cycle. So, um, sorry about that tangent. Uh, so, no processed foods. Processed foods are gonna make you more tired and maybe you're not eating enough. If you're feeling really, really tired, it could be because of low blood sugar. And that could be a reason why you, you know, if you go a long time without eating and you are like, oh man, I want something carbolicious and full of fat right now. And you just eat, 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 eat. And then you get this blood sugar spike and then you, f you feel like you get your energy back and then poof, crash. That's when your blood sugar crashes down again and then you feel hungry again. So you just ride the wave of being hungry and tired all day long. I, I've been there because I've had my binge days, don't worry. Um, that's why you wanna make sure that you are eating, you know, kind of all day long, whether they're small meals or whether you have a big meal then a snack, big meal then a snack. Eating whole foods and eating all day long, it's gonna help you to not get those blood sugar spikes and feel tired. So those are my three tips. Drink more water, get your body moving, don't eat those processed foods and make sure that you're eating all day long. So I hope these tips help you guys. Have a wonderful day and thank you guys so much for taking the time to watch this.